Hello everyone and welcome to Bop Bop Battles on Mineplex. So this is a brand new game, so I have two goals for it. One is that I do well and two is that I show you some good tips for this game. So this game you can try and knock people off the edge, rush always, do not stay back, that's where you die. And oh wow, we just walked off the edge. That's bad. At least we weren't the first one to die. So we're just gonna wait for this end real quick. We're off to a bad start. But normally I do better towards the end of the game, so now this one is I think the Oh nope this diamond hunt. I thought it was gonna be the um block game. So I'm just going to try and find um a diamond from the chest. It has to be a diamond, not an ore or anything, or a block or a sword or anything like that. It needs to be a diamond. So that is a lot of luck in that game and how fast do you open chest. And so this one is punch a pig, you need to go quickly because the pigs go fat fast. And we didn't get pigs by us. So we did bad. We did bad. We got unlucky that time. It's a lot easier when you have a lot of pigs to kill by you. But now around fast food, this one's pretty easy for me. You basically it's how fast you can click and how fast you can switch the hot bar items around. That you click really fast on this. And we're the first one done. Okay, there we go. Now let's see what the next one is. It's lagging a bit. Let's see. Red light, green light. I'm pretty good at this. Except when it glitches. Sometimes it glitches, which is bad. I only did that once, so uh, for me. And it's working for us now. That's good. So in this, you can do a jump after it turns red. So take advantage of that. Plus to change it. Probably won't. We're way ahead of everyone. Uh, look how far we beat and everyone by. We moved our red light as we just saw. Get pushed back. That guy is keep on getting pushed back. That guy just keep on running. He doesn't stop. Does see. And he finished. I guess maybe that's a good strategy if you're not really good at this. People aren't jumping, maybe they're all glitching, or I don't know. But if you jump, it's a lot easier. Okay, next round it is bouncing block. You need to hit the blocks in the air. Each is worth one point, color doesn't matter. And don't hit the red things on the ground. You don't need to worry too much about that. Just slightly worry about the fox in the air and the ground. There we go. First one. Complete that. And one person dies. People that fell off. Just gonna wait for others. Oh, I think I should be. Just gonna wait real quick. Three people dead, three people completed. Ooh, fireworks particles. And four people completed, four people died. Okay, there. Now people are completing without dying. Okay, good. No one has five lives still. We're in tied for fourth place with two others. Yeah, three left and reverse tag. I'm bad at this. So, you want to tag the people with the wool on their head. And a lot of times I have wool until the very end. And then it keeps me mad. The key, I'm probably about to get tagged. Right now I'm about to get tagged. And, or we're going to make it. We might make it. Oh, we made it that time. Nice. And now we're back in first, tied with four others. Now water horror. And this one you kinda wanna get in the center. The edges are more dangerous. 
as you can see a lot most people are going to go to service team because they know what they're doing and you want to be careful because everyone's while TNT is a player and it like um, kills a lot of people in the center and we beat that now there's only one person tied with us we're doing pretty well now chicken shooting I'm not very good at this you want to shoot six chickens in the air don't get them mixed up for um baby chicken players or oh, sometimes baby chickens too small in the air like that one if you're flying around kind of weirdly then you're a player you now I don't see any player oh there's a player flying around see one more okay good we beat it so hopefully the guy in first doesn't make it so we can have it all to ourselves I want the guy with one life to make it, but okay. now we're in first all by ourselves and smash off. I'm bad at this. Rook gonna try and get to that corner though. And see, that's how bad I am at that. Sometimes it like I think it gives you slowness. Sometimes it gives you speed. On that time, it's speed. So it made it difficult. Uh, we still have two lives left. And milk a cow. I never failed at this one yet, and I hope not to. So you want to find a cow by you to start with that is far away. So, because you only can milk each cow once. You go quick. And we reverse there. Go well. Four players left. Each round, half the players are lose a life. Unless it runs out of time and arrow rampage. Um, Shoot arrows at the ground, destroys it, kind of like super sleeve as archer, kind of more or less. Okay, there's gonna be two people that uh, there's gonna be one other person that needs to die, and also try and stay on the top part because the arrows, um, if an arrow lands on your block, then it doesn't um, go all the way through if you're on um, top all layer, but if you're like below it, then the arrow can it can fall off. So as long as you're on like this part, then you can't fall. And now we're in first by ourselves again. And this one smash an egg, destroy ten dragon eggs. Try and get away from people on this. And try and find the area with lots of eggs. We keep spawning. As you can see, and we beat it. There we go. Okay, thank you all for watching. I hope you learned some good shit, um, trip tips from this. And I hope you had fun watching, and that's it for today. Please leave a comment and a like. Goodbye.